Hey guys, what's up? I'm Mason the Mason with Wyatt and Sons Construction. In today's video, we're doing a whole bunch of stuff for this enormous pool deck. Right, the first try. step is we're pouring a curb over here. Right there. They're wheeling around. The truck's way over there. They're coming through that gate. Over here. And we gotta shovel it into this curb. This is step one. So all we're doing today is pouring this curb. This is one of the biggest pools I've seen in, in Pennsylvania. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Um, I was not here when we ripped, they ripped out all the concrete, so I don't got any videos of that. But this was a deck. They ripped out all the concrete. I'm in charge of smoothing out the top, so here's my sword. Scooping it in. Can't really dump it. Um, also, another dilemma is it's way too wet. So we might have to wait a little bit. But, yeah, get her done. Smag off the top like that. Using my dark light screen. Yuking it down like that. Check this out. This is how you get you don't have any honeycombs. You take a block trowel like Saul's doing and rub the edge with it. You, you got any techniques to show the viewers, Sawyer? Nope. Yeah, just, just slam it, just stab it in there. Yeah, pretty much. Not real difficult things we're doing here. And then he hit, hits it with a hammer. What that does is make all the cream on the outside nice and smooth. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, we usually never really have problems like this or mess up a whole lot. Like everybody makes mistakes and everything, but we, we're real slim with them. And all this was just filled with concrete. It was so wet that we were worried that it was gonna crack and stuff. So we had to scoop it out with shovels and trowels and then yeah, it's all, it's all spraying the forms down again. We had to wash them out with water. I mean, this type of thing happens sometimes. I mean, Give it a drink. <laughs> <laughs> so we're re restarting here. New concrete, actual stiff concrete that we need for curves. Doesn't that look better? So yeah, much better. better. Way I mean, less we'll nervous. Stuff like that. I agree. So now, same thing as first time. We're going to shovel it in, uke it, tap it with a hammer, all that good stuff. Again, we scoop it in, we uke it. Saul's troweling the edge, hitting it with a hammer, all that stuff. So don't forget any of those things. I'm gonna put on a time lapse now of the wheelbarrows and scooping. All done pouring this curb, and Dad started putting an edge on the that side. And then we're gonna put an edge on this side. Making sure the fence is all clean. Good job. Silly willies over here edging. Again. Again. Almost about time to leave here. We're gonna have to leave you to it, big man. Uh, I hope you can handle it from the rest of the way. Uh, hope this I won't isn't call too back much up or tell anybody that it's fucked up until it's too late. All right, good. <laughs> Saul's curve turned out really nice. We're on to the second pour here. Concrete truck is here. They're getting all ready, spinning up the mud, getting the wheelbarrows around. And we're gonna pour over here. Bulkhead right there, got my screed ready. And we're gonna pour all the concrete that he has in his truck as far as we can go and then bulkhead it off. Same thing as the other day, they gotta come through the gate here. Truck's on the road, they're gonna wheelbarrow it through here down the ramp, over to where we're pouring. Good. Got the Jake's wheeling, Will wheeling, and Saul's raking, and I'm screeding. Right here. Starting our finishing process here. Mud boards are spread out. I already got one strip of swirls going along, just going right along the pool. Looking real fancy. All done finishing. Very proud of this. And shade where it was still real wet, but we finished her, got her done. 
about to seal this section. What's up guys? It's Saul out here today. Stole Mason's camera. to show you what's going on. They're wheeling from all the way out there and through that gate over there, down that plank, all the way over there, around the ladder, around the diving board, back over to the pool house. The reason we're doing that is because we don't want to go over our existing concrete and get it all dirty. We're not even done edging yet, and this thing is starting to blow up in the sun, so we have to get right after it. So we're spreading the mud boards out, and we're going to start brushing this. Oh. Got half of it finished. Just got this big section in the shade yet. All done pouring, finishing, hedging, control joints, all done. All we got left is to take these forms off, so we're going to go get some food and then come back and get all our stuff. You also have to seal it, so only a few more things to do and we're out of here. guys are setting this big slide up here oh yeah how's it going almost there almost there Feeling holes. 